Hello and welcome to whiskey.com where fine spirits meet. And today we have a very, very classical cocktail. And it's so classical that it's actually an official cocktail from the Bartenders Association. And this one is called the Horse's Neck. Unfortunately, uh, as we sell these cocktail boxes in Germany, we don't have all the ingredients for the horse's neck because we don't sell fresh fruit. But you usually do the horse's neck with fresh fruit. The name horse's neck comes from the decoration of the cocktail. You have a spiral of the zest of a lemon and it spirals down in the glass and at the top it just peeks out and it looks like a horse's neck. So that's why this cocktail is called a horse's neck. It's a classical highball, so um, as, uh, as the bourbon, we take the uh, Maker's Mark. And um, yeah, first you, oh, usually first you, you bring in a bit of ice. Um, then you add six CLs, six Cs of, uh, of bourbon. Horse's neck reminds me of a, of a, a story of of a, an old friend, and he was just sitting at the at the table at the kitchen table, and he was reading his newspaper, and his wife comes up with uh, with a frying pan. Usually, you just fill it up, but today I'm measuring just to show you how how it adds up to 0.2 liters. And so she comes up with a frying pan, hits him over the head, and he goes, "What the hell? What, what are you doing?" And she shows him uh, a piece of paper with the name Marie Louise on it. And she's, she goes, well, who the hell is Marie Louise? And he goes, yeah, two weeks ago I was at the horse races and this was the horse that I betted on. And she was like, oh, I'm very sorry. And she was like, she really had, uh, she was really sorry all day and she was, it was bugging her and, and she was apologizing to him a lot. And, that was a horrible situation and then three days later and she comes up to him and she hits him over the head and he was always again what the hell is happening and she goes I saw yeah your horse called <laughs> hmm whoa whoa hmm the the bitter is really really strong so um, I think I had a bit, maybe I had three dashes instead of two, but it's a, a really, really, really spicy and deep whiskey cocktail. So the, the Maker's Mark is, is a forward, light, mm, delicate bourbon. That goes really into the back. There's only, only a bit of vanilla and a bit of caramel and a bit of sweetness left, combined with the sweetness from the ginger ale. But the ginger ale also has a bit of a, a spiciness to it and a bit of... Mm, a bit of oomph to it. So that adds up to a, a whiskey cocktail that has really a lot of spiciness. Mm, I would really love to see that cocktail again with a, a bit of more, uh, a bourbon that has a bit more rye content in it because it would be a, a really, really spa uh, spicy whiskey. Mm -hmm. Like a, a Knob Creek rye or something like that that would just give it a much, much more boost, but it still already is a, a very spicy cocktail. So if you like the, the spicy cocktails, feel free to just try out your, your horse's neck and don't forget the lemon because that's what a horse's neck is made of. I don't have it today, but anyway. Thank you very much for watching and see you next time.